Hi, how can I help you? I'm here for the job. Oh, sure, follow me. Excuse me, sir. Sir? Sir, excuse me? Sir. We've got an applicant here for the job position. Uh, yeah. Come in. What can I do for you, Junior? Take a seat. I'm, uh, I saw your advertisement. Wait, 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 hold on. Uh, what are you doing here so late? My business is only for a couple hours and it's almost 11 o'clock. I mean, fuck. I'd like to get home to my wife. Um, is the position still available? Okay, about the position, the advertisement, that's like a yield. There's no job anymore for you. What? Sir, is it okay if I head home now? You sure can, banana top. Thanks. So, uh, uh, where were we? Oh yes, we were discussing your late appearance. Um, I don't know how to say this. I, in a matter of words, I didn't have any other choice. Could you be more specific? I, I blame it on this bag. Whoa. I think the bag is made specifically for me. I can carry it easily, but other times are difficult. Walking along a smooth road or flat surface, that's easy. But try to take this big old bag up one of those steep San Francisco slopes, and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. Everything's different now. I'm not myself anymore. The bag chooses my path. I'm no longer free to do as I wish. The bag decides my destination. So, let me get this straight. Because of that bag, that's why you're here? Yeah, I think so. So without the bag, you go to, let's say, another office. Different destination. <laughs> without the bag? What are you, crazy? Whoa, 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 calm down, Chief. I'm just saying, what you got in there, a bomb? No, I don't think so. I still don't understand this complex relationship between you and that bag. Complex? I mean, it's not complex. I hold it voluntarily. I can put it down whenever I want. Uh, okay, genius. What happens if I don't give you this job? Well, I'll just come back tomorrow. And the day after that. And then the day after that until I get this fucking job. Uh -huh. Unless World War III breaks out. Why, you're, you're not gonna hire me? Oh, no, no, no. I'm just, uh, just give you some options. Since, uh, it looks like the bag controls you. I don't think you understand. I mean, I'm the only one who knows about this bag and what it can do. Let me try the bag. No way, are you crazy? What's inside it? It's not our concern. You show anyone else what's inside the bag? No, never. It's way too valuable. What's it worth? Nothing of material value. I can only imagine what you look like walking down the street with that bag leading you. <laughs> what? Okay, you got yourself a job. Under one circumstance. You cannot bring that bag into this office. It's way too big. That sound good? Sounds great, thank you. By the way, where would you put that bag if you were gonna work here? Well, I'll just leave it at my place. You gonna be okay? With what? I'm just saying that usually you need the bag to go places. Can you get back home without that magical bag? Well, hopefully the place I find will be near here. By the way, since you've been so nice to me today, mind if I leave it here overnight? Sure, why not? Right here, it'd be great. Well, I'll uh, see you tomorrow. See you bright and early. Baby.